Greetings and welcome back everybody for another exciting episode of Nostalgic Notions, a fun little series where we play about 15 to 20 minutes of an old retro game. This is actually another exciting game. In the previous episode we played the original Metroid, and now we're playing the original Legend of Zelda game. This is another game like the original Metroid, this is another game that I actually did play in the past, but I never got very far into it. Ganon, the King of Evil, has broken free of the Dark World and has captured Hyrule's beloved Princess Zelda. But before she was caught, Princess Zelda managed to shatter the Triforce of Wisdom and scatter its eight pieces throughout Hyrule. You begin your adventure by finding a small wooden sword in a dark cave. Then, as you grow in stature, experience, and strength, so do your weapons. Help Link collect the captured pieces of the Triforce, rescue the princess, and thwart Ganon's evil plans. And this is a version of the game where you start off with a lot of rubies and items. And you begin with all equipment, including the white sword, magical shield, blue ring, and even the power bracelet. We can check that out, but let's obviously start with the main game. 1986? I don't know why it said 1987 earlier. This is 1986. Original Zelda. Register your name. Okay. I will. How many letters do I get? D? You, where's the U? I can't remember letters. Duck. Okay. How do I... How do I end? How do I... I don't know. How do you get to... How do I do it? Did I do it? Okay, here we go. <laughs> so... Dangerous to go alone. Take this. Famous words. <laughs> For some reason. Why is that so famous? I'm not really sure. Link has a sword now! Hooray! And when he has full health, you can do that. I don't think you can do that otherwise. So that's very cool. I have, Like I said, I played the original Zelda. I always had a really hard time with it though. I never got very far. I never got very far. I got through like one or two dungeons. My problem was it was hard and I also had no idea where anything was. It's really confusing to get around in this game. I should have looked up a map though. What, what would have made this game a bit easier is if I had maybe looked up a map I could have found things better. Would have been very helpful. Is this a dungeon? It is kind of cool that you have a- uh, you can like wander around the entire, uh, map. It's kind of- it's, it's kind of like Breath of the Wild because it's kind of open and you can go any direction you want. Well, we fi found a dungeon. Let's see. Let's see if we can get anywhere in it. Probably gonna be too tough for me. I'm not really sure what's the first dungeon you should start. The earliest Zelda game that I actually play quite a lot was A Link to the Past on the Super Nintendo. But I never really played the original Zelda much at all. Or any other early Zelda games. Ooh, another key! Get the skellies! Get the skellies, Link! You can keep that ability, that'll be helpful. Got some more money. How do I... How do I use it? Okay, there we go. I couldn't find anything. I got, I got lost really easily. I did find several dungeons, but I only finished like one or two of them. Level 1, actually, is that like, is this the first dungeon or is this like the first floor of this particular dungeon? I'm just curious. It'd be cool if we could get through a dungeon in this episode. Probably won't, but that'd be cool though. This is yet another old Nintendo game that I've been, that I want to get through, but I don't think I ever will. Let's get all the enemies just in case. 
finally getting used to using the Switch's control pad. It's always been hard for me to use the way the buttons are, like, separate and everything. It's easier when a control pad is one single button. It makes a big difference. I can keep my health. I'll keep having this awesome ability. Okay. <sighs> Be careful, Link! Alright. This is locked. Do I still have... I have a key. Oh yeah, I see the key on there. What are those? Cool. Eastmost Peninsula is the secret. Uh, alright. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to attack you. It was an accident. <laughs> sorry, dude. <laughs> I don't know what he was talking about, Link, but let's keep going. More enemies. What is that thing over there? Oh, looks like a map. Cool. Oh, those things take several hits. Better be careful. Oh no, and they have like boomerangs. Oh no, Link! No, Link! No! Now you can't fight as well. Oh. Ooh, I got a boomerang now. That's cool. Okay. Ah! There's hands! No, Link! Oh no, Link! We have a key, though. Where does this go? This looks like it leads to a dead end. Oh! Is this the boss? Does the, does the boomerang work on this thing? Doesn't seem to. Should I just attack it? Oh! <laughs> How do I get it? I think you're gonna die. <laughs> I think that was the first, uh... We can continue. Hmm. Let's go farther into the dungeon. I don't know. How do you, uh... How do you defeat... I gotta keep my health this time. Gotta be more careful. How do you defeat the dragon? I don't remember. I think I have defeated the dragon before, but I don't remember how. I don't remember what I did. Oh, cool. That'll make things easier. So... I don't remember where I've been. I'm just gonna go. I'm just curious. I think I've been to the left. I don't know what those things are. go. Where have I been, Link? I don't remember. We haven't been here. Alright. Shouldn't be too much trouble. We don't have any keys at the moment, so hopefully this guy has it. Yep. What do we use to defeat the dragon, Link? Stay away from those guys. With their boomerangs. Very deadly. Very intimidating. Nice.
Oh! I recognize those from A Link to the Past. Yeah, I bet one of these you can push. Just try all of them. I'll just try every side and see what happens. Which one could it be, Link? Ah! Oh! Awesome. Ooh! I wanna... I'm not doing good. But I wanted to make a save point here. So that must be how you defeat the dragon. You don't use the boomerang, you use the bow. How do you how do you choose an item? I don't really get how you go over to that. I don't know. Well, how do I use the bow, Link? Oh, stop. Don't go up the ladder. Stop that. I'm a little confused. Oh, I don't need to do that. There we go. Well, that's how you defeat the dragon, I'm, I'm sure, but I don't understand how you, uh... I don't really get how you select the bow in the first place. What do we do, Link? What do we do? Okay, so I looked it up. You can't equip the bow until you have arrows. So, I gotta figure out how to get arrows. That's how it works. I was confused. I don't know if I can get any arrows from enemies or if it's something I'll have to buy. Kinda cool if we could defeat the dragon in this episode. Would be pretty cool. What do you think, Link? Let's see if we can find someone to buy arrows from. Let's see, Link. Let's see what we can do. Let's get out of here. Actually, I've gone that way, yeah. I wonder where I can get some arrows. Gotta make sure I can get back to this place. I don't think it was too hard to find, though. Red Link! Run! Let's find somebody! Anybody! I don't know. Yeah, I'm not really sure. It, it would be cool if we could get... Oh, I died. <laughs> it would be kind of cool if we could, uh... Let's continue. Be cool if we could get through a dungeon. So I got my money still. Nope, that guy's not here. I can't remember where you buy stuff from. Is there anyone here? No. No, you don't have arrows. I need arrows. Where is someone that can sell me arrows? Oh. I don't really know. <laughs> it would have been kind of cool to show you guys the dragon and to actually defeat it and everything. But, oopsie. Oh no. Oh no. But yeah, it depends on if we can find arrows anytime soon. Nostalgic Notions is 15 to 20 minutes. That's the rule, and 
I ain't breaking the sacred rule of nostalgic notions. So if we can't find arrows soon, we might just have to quit this, which is kind of a shame. You know what? Actually, let me try something. Uh, what am I doing? Let me, let me do this. So this version, you actually should have everything. Oh, how do you how do you do that? So Link should be really strong now. Let's let's see if we can go back to the dungeon and get through it really fast. We should have the we should have the bow now, shouldn't we? Oh, we still don't have the bow, but we do have arrows. Let me see. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. <sighs> oh, there's apparently something here. What's this? It's a secret to everybody. Okay. I don't know what you're talking about. <sighs> Let's see. So the dungeon was up here. Let's see. Let's see if we can just get through it. Let's just go. We got a bunch of keys and everything. So apparently you can buy keys and everything. I don't have a map, though. Hopefully we'll remember where we're supposed to go. Goodbye, bats. Let's see if I can remember where we're going. Oh, there's a map. There's a map. Let's get that bow. So we go up here. I think the bow is this way. Yeah. This way. Whoopsie. I don't care. I'm just gonna go right through. <laughs> Let's get ourselves. So it's over here. Let's see if we can defeat the dragon before we end this episode. Hooray! Okay. Now we got it. So we got arrows. Let's defeat the dragon, maybe. If we can. I know where to go. So it shouldn't be too hard. Come on, Link, just a little further. Kinda nice having all these keys and everything. This is the easy way to get through the game. The easy, effortless way. Where got my health back? Cool. Oh no! No 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 no! No! No the hands! Not the hands! Oh. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Jerky hands. Get in there, Link. Gotta watch out for the hands. Got the boomerang. I don't want to get messed up by the hands again, so let me see. I want to get grabbed again. Okay, Link. Let's get to that dragon. We're almost there. Actually, this is the dragon. Here we are. Get that dragon! How are you not hitting it? Gotta hit the head, maybe. I think. There we go. 
cool. And here is a piece of the Triforce. Hooray! Well, that was the original Zelda, everybody. A momentous occasion for nostalgic notions indeed. Thank you so much for watching, and as usual, don't forget to visit us at virtualbastion.com for more gaming goodness. Goodbye, and you're welcome.